uh, instead of steering straight, of course you're either going to go to the left or the right. And uh, if it's a big enough bottle, you know, it can even cause an accident uh, for the customer. Uh, one recommendation I would do is every so often uh, get your alignment checked. You know, that way uh, everything's intact and get your front end checked as well. If we go on a road test and, you know, say every car tends to have a little rattle over the years, and uh, Stone Church is the best place for a rattle, test a rattle. Now that they're fixing it, it's like we're going to have to find another road. <laughs> yes, West 5th Road is not built to handle the amount of traffic that we have here now, and um, it's starting to deteriorate. There's cracks, there's uh, manhole covers that are loose. Lots of traffic, <laughs> and today's quiet compared to during the week. And this is the um, the corner where I was saying about the uh, cars and trucks and buses going in. You can see the marks where it happens. Um, and, and there's been a couple of times in the last year where cars have gone in and then lost control and they end up going in the ditch and swerving on the road up on Chester Street. It's a bad one, and it needs to be fixed. Uh, in regards to uh, West 5th, uh, certainly between Lime Ridge and Rymel is still a rural cross section. Uh, it's certainly a rough road that uh, needs uh, some attention, tender loving care. Uh, but the reality is, is that there's still lots of land to be developed along the stretch between Lime Ridge and Rymel and until that land is uh, developed it, it is not practical to have uh, all these road cuts to provide services to those developments after the road was done. So the challenge we're having is, is the chicken and egg is waiting for all that development to be completed so that all the road cuts are done, all the services are, are provided for the uh, development and then we come in and uh, fix up the road. So that's the uh, unfortunate challenge with West 5th. How many years are you looking at? Well, uh, the good news is we just got the uh, water sewer in on West 5th uh, in the last uh, two or three years, which allows us, enables us to provide uh, uh, development opportunities. And currently uh, we had an EA completed in regards to storm management uh, issues. My understanding, we're very close to having those issues resolved. Uh, which opens up those lands for development. And of course, after that, our job is done. It's up to the market and uh, the development community to make those investments. So I would say probably within the next five years. pick up a ballot where they can also place their votes and our member service consultants can handle the ballots for them, send them into head office to make sure that they're counted for.